Hello, everybody. Welcome back to the void. I'm player one, and welcome back to Multiverses. Last time, we began the Rift Detectives chapter, which is the second rift, uh, concerning Velma and trying to find uh, this little, this little nasty thing right here, Stripe. So, after the last part, it's been a few days, it is now day... 10? It is now day 10. And we just got a patch. Which is very cool. A um, bunch of buffs and nerfs for, for characters. But the big thing, the huge thing, is that you can now earn Battle Pass experience just from doing fights. So it should make the Battle Pass way easier to get. Uh, so yeah. Also, rip to uh to my boy iron giant because right now he's still uh he's still in the workshop because he's got a bunch of bugs and he's cracked and yeah so rip to my boy he'll he'll be back and also i've been getting um you know miscellaneous things right here like icons or something and i now have a hundred thousand prestige Yes. Oh. And he gave me 9600, so I still have a good amount now. But there he is. The Batman who laughs. Oh, it's wonderful. And speaking of Joker, the Joker's ruse is now done. I have done enough. So I would say this is the second event done, but really the first big one done. So yeah, give me this Wonder Woman. With the the Gotham Guardian, the shirt. Very cool. We have nabbed the Joker. And there we go. Now, we are ready to go back into here. Also, I've done some of the experienced ones. You know, just because I could. Gem level 2. Let's go back into here, and let's wrap this up, and hopefully start the Jason one. Alright, five dash attacks, human adventure time, so gimme Finn. Right, let's see here. And I've also noticed something, the, the effects of the gems are not as important as just the level of them. Because look at this. You can have a taunt and you get plus 50% attack, or you can have a level 2 one with plus 100. So it's... It's, it's just... Yeah. There we go. Don't take this personally, but if anyone is going to find a gem, I think it should be me. Yeah. <laughs> But Garnet, you have you have no Prepare yourselves. You weren't even included in the conversation. You've just showed up. And now you're fighting us for some reason. Reflect damage? This, about to get Does Garnet have What the hell? Yeah, it was it was five. There we are. Damn! Damn! You see, you see how important gem levels are. It doesn't matter what the gem is, just as long as it's a high level, you you will win. That's how I won um, the crushing difficulty on Multiversal Madness, the first rift. Because I was stuck on that for a bit, I'll be honest. I was stuck on it because there are quite a few tag team matches where it's just you and two opponents. But all I needed was just a couple more gem levels and then I breezed through the rest of it. An interesting, interesting thing to mention about that. On crushing, the Joker boss fight 
changed. It had a different mechanic. You had to get ammo for the cannon by hitting the jack-in-the-boxes. So it definitely took a while longer, and he had more health. But still, I still defeated it. So I'm now on three bosses out of... 20. By the way, no, no one can get Smith right now. There's not enough rifts open. Just, just to let you know, in case you were curious. Alright, we got another tank. I, why? Why? Why another tank? Heard about the detective showdown? Love it. Personally, I think you should both get trapped in here, as I destroyed the dimensional pathways with these lovely drones. Quick, defend that crystal. The crystal is keeping the dimensional pathways open? Right? And I guess, I guess it makes sense we're defending it. But I'll be honest, out of all the minigames so far, this is my least favorite. I don't like this one. It has weird controls. Oh, what the hell is that? Oh, now it's even harder. Great. I very much enjoy that. What the hell? How did how did I do this? I I don't know how I've done this. There's power-ups in this? Oh god damn it. There's there's power-ups. What? Oh, and these things do so much damage. This sucks. Yeah, I don't like this minigame. And there's still one more. Yuck. Huh. Yeah, you know, I've been I've been positive about this game even when no one else has been. But I don't I don't like that mini game. I can succinctly say that. Aw, why are you ruining Mr. J's fun, Bat Brain? Harley, we're trying to solve a mystery here. Sure, sure, you do that, but I'll be over here having a fan club meeting for Mr. J. <laughs> fan club, you say? All right, so now these ones, you need a costume with a t-shirt. So... There's one for Garnet, there's one for Harley, there's one for Soup, there's one for Yoke, one for Wonder Woman, and one for Velma. You will get these two if you finish the Joker event, and if you just log in, you will get these two. So, be in the air, a uh, human, DC. Yeah, so, I think you may just need the Wonder Woman one. Welcome to this Rift's first ever meeting of the Joker Fan Club. You here for your introductory beating? <laughs> Harley. Well, I guess it makes sense for Wonder Woman, because she's not repping Joker. But if I was Velma, I would have the Joker shirt on. So why would you beat me up? I think this should be a fine warm up. All right. And I'm pretty sure I I haven't encountered it enough to know, but I think the be in the air ones are 
cumulative. You don't have to be in the air for 10 straight seconds, just 10 seconds total. Which definitely makes it way easier. And there you are. Stand by. Very simple. This is barely a workout. Wait. So Wait a second. Is Wonder Woman not considered a human? Hey, hang on a damn minute. Wh what? Non-human. Superman's a Kryptonian. Garnet is a crystal gem. Wonder Woman's from Themyscira, which is on Earth. She's... she's a human, and Amazon is a human. How the hell does that... what? I... 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 Sure... Whatever you say, game. What? Whatever you say. Still don't have a square horror gem. Alright, so this one is a non-human, so this one I need to use Wonder Woman. Fully charged attack. Should not be too bad. I do so adore seeing my fans getting together for meat and beats. But I'm beginning to expect you may not be the true Joker superfan you claim to be. I never claimed to be one, I'm reppin' Batman. Alright, now it's just a regular fight. Not sure why this one is a horror one. Would you consider Joker a horror character? I wouldn't. <laughs> that was a funny one. And there we go. There we go. Wait, no. We just- that's a new digital one. Buddy Bubble is 50% easier to pop. That sucks. That is a horrible gem. Why would you- why would you have that? You could only use that if you have someone in your party. And then again, the bubble isn't that hard to pop. All right, let's finish this little this little sideline. All right, human DC. Okay, I guess I'll I'll use Wonder Woman again. Actually, no, been using her too much. Give me Velma. Two hundred damage. Okay. Batman, what are you doing here? I'm here to break up this little fan club before it can even get off the ground. Fight for me, my adoring fan. Now, now it makes sense, because I am actually a Joker fan now. Do you really need all those gadgets? Again, this is only my second time playing as Velma, so I have to, I have to figure out what she does. Thank you. 
Doesn't she have a special that... She... Doesn't she have, like, a beam special? If she does... Or if she did, I'm not sure what it is. There we are. Alright. Now let's get back to the main path and finish this up. Only three more. Shaggart. Alright. Human DC. Be in the air. Well, you say human in DC. Oh! Batman Who Laughs is a detective. Yeah, I guess that makes sense, because he's, he's a Bruce Wayne, so, yeah. Like, I'm getting real tired of seeing Batman turn this into a stupid competition, man. If you want, I'll calm down. I'll have to do something about it myself. Why are you tired, Shaggy? Who voices him? Because that's not Mark Hamill. And obviously it's not Kevin Conroy. So who who voices him? I'll have to look that up. Oh, he has a different flag. That's cool. And there we are. And that is that all the the gem? Yeah. And I've got to 80, so I've got all the, the missions I needed. Yeah, this rift is cleaned up. Just... Huh. Another tank mission. And then the boss. By the way, I haven't used Tom and Jerry yet, because... If you remember, the power pledge thing, where you get a, a tier for each level up... They're having another one, so I'm m making sure I don't use them for when that uh, comes back. Hey, do all these cuts and slashes look like they came from... A buzzsaw. Stripe must have come this way. Let's protect these crystals and then catch up to him. Gotta say... I like the new stuff they had in this one, the like ghosts and stuff, but why, why three of the same mini game? I don't like that one. You had like four in the first one. Oh, now we've got big beefy boys. Yeah, I don't think this is a power up. This this one this one actually kind of sucks. So yeah, no, note to you, 
do not pick up the the rapid fire. It's not as good as you think. Grenade? Eh. I think I think just stay with the regular shot or get the spread shot. The other ones eh. Yeah, this one. Get this one. Okay. Victory! Damn! I can't wait to try that even more on the higher difficulties huh. but here we are stripe boss it says stripe swarm so I'm expecting a lot of them all right uh, win the match for the gremlins with them win the match with an adventure time uh, so I guess I guess give me gizmo cutscene yes There he is! Grab him! Easy, Stripe. Just hand over the gem. Ah! Go away, go away, go away! More cutscenes, please. <laughs> More cutscenes, please. Alright. Ew. Ew. Pustulating unduals. More, more stripes. Oh no. Oh, but they're mini stri No, those are regular stripes. The boss is a big stripe. Okay, not uh, not as you unique as the Joker one, but still pretty cool. Easy schmeasy. And that's another boss. Very nice. <laughs> Stripe! Stripe lose, Gem, okay? You lost it? Oh no. What do you remember? Tell us. Machete. Machete? What the heck does that mean? Not sure but it sounds like a job for the multiverse's best detectives. I know what machete means. It's time for a very, very scary man. Oh no, that means he's gonna be the boss. Oh no. All right, well first let me get this. Yum. Perk currency. I don't... I, I don't need any perk currency. I have 150,000. I don't need any more. I could literally buy out, like, everyone's perks and still have a fuck ton left. I don't need it. How about all right? I think we, uh, we start this. Jason versus the multiverse. And this one has even less uh, matches, so it should be quick.
It's just a weirdo in a mask. It's always just a weirdo in a mask. I don't know, dude. You see his sword? I had serious bad vibes. It was a machete, not a sword. And he was probably just doing some yard work earlier. If you call murdering dudes yard work. Okay, gang. I think... Watch my face holes! All right! Show yourself! Please, more cutscenes. Let's fight our way out of this. Oh, damn. I thought it would have less. This seems like still a good amount. Man, the dailies are all the way over there. Mm. Alright, let's get started. I can only use Finn. Wait a minute, I can only use Finn? What if I didn't have Finn? Could I just not progress on this rift? Hmm. Alright, well, let's, uh, let's go. I can't even use any variants. That's a little weird. And I still have no horror squares. Alright, let's go. Three up specials, ten neutrals. Like, slow your buns, man! Why are you trying to hunt all of us? <sighs> oh, that's a cool banner. Look at that. That one's cool. Also, you notice how they were in, like, a movie theater? What, uh, what was that about? Or was it a train? I could not tell. I think it was a movie theater? I saw I'm gonna have to fight Jason quite a bit. And this is a tanky fellow. He takes a lot of hits. This makes me wonder, do you think every character's gonna get a boss? Like, we had a Joker boss, we had a Stripe boss, we're gonna have a Jason boss. So is all of them going to have, like, a boss variant? That would be cool. I don't know what you would do for all of them, though. Like, how would you do a Velma boss? Or maybe just the villain characters. I don't know. I, I can tell from the the next Rift preview that the boss is probably going to be Dexter's robot because they showed that in the Rift, like, overview video. Wait a minute. There's a square one. If the next Rift boss is Dexter's robot, is Dexter soon? Maybe. Maybe. Alright, now I can finally get a red square. Give me that. Alright. Uh hmm. I think we'll do we'll do these three more. Alright. Uh Scooby character, human character, freeze the opponent three times. I guess we'll go Velma. Velma has quite a lot of costumes. Let me guess. Another monster breaking into my cave, and disguised as Velma. Batman, wait, it's me! Bruce, how the hell do you not... Prepare yourself. 
how do you not know it's her? Who would disguise as Velma? Oh, permafrost gauntlets. Yeah, that that that'll do it. All right, that's two. And that's three. Now I can win. That's a rare gem, since it had the glow. Sorry, Dinkley. I think this rift is messing with my mind. Don't worry, Batman. I'm gonna get to the bottom of it. Let's do the soups one. Uh, gremlins, non-human, 50 damage. <laughs> Gimme stride. Ah, more monsters. I guess it makes sense I'm using Stripe then. Oh no, wait. Or maybe it's the same as the Batman one, but this time... Superman thinks Gizmo's a monster? Kaka! Stripe's pretty good. I like using him. Nice and simple. Alright, and now let's do this last one. Well, sorry, that was quite the misunderstanding. Are you okay? If we're going to get out of this, we need to be careful. Yeah, he thought Gizmo was a monster. What? Alright, another Jason fight. Uh, Adventure Time, human, 50 damage. So it's looking like Finn again. Narrator? What? Okay. And so our heroes were drawn further and further into this rift of horrors and into the clutches of Jason Voorhees. I'm gonna guess the narrator talks for Jason and he's the like movie announcer. Prepare Makes sense. Yourself. Weird how they made him like a robed figure. There could be hidden lore right there. Very interesting. You know, people had the idea of, oh, what if, what if his mother talked for him, like, uh, like he did in the, in the game, in the Friday the Thirteenth game. 
And that would be cool, but I also heard that maybe that's like some copyright stuff. I don't know. Jason's copyright is like very weird because he has two owners. So I, I'm really not sure what they could do with him. But they, they got him the, the Jason X costume and well, he's got references to, you know, his kills and stuff, so. It, he's basically like fully here. Maybe it's just his mother that's like weird. But I will take the movie announcer. That is also a good choice. This is barely a work By my sword. Nice. Oh, nice. Five percent to not bounce when you're hit. Hmm. That may be good. Also, if you've noticed, there's the Joker event thing that's uh, play PvE two times, and I didn't get any of that. I think that's just a bug, but luckily I, I don't need to do it, because I already finished the uh, the event. So, yeah. Alright, and I think with that, we'll end it there. Also, I've been noticing this. They got, they got people wearing Jason masks. Now, is that just exclusive to here, or can we, can we get that? Because that would be, that'd be interesting to have. But I guess we'll, uh, I guess we'll see. All right. And with that, I'll end it there. I've been Player One, and I'll see you next time when we fight Jason even more times. And then do a big Jason. Oh man. Alright. Bye bye.